Hey everyone, welcome back to the Pang Hush channel. So get this, there's a miner that basically gives you the power of two L9. It's quietly damn your fridge and the top of script network efficiency. Today, we are diving into the Walk Miner D1 Hydro. And trust me, we are gonna test and the hell out of it. It's known as the most baddest water cool miner on the market right now. We are talking top tier like corn hash rate and some insane cooling design. Just how strong is the script mining beast? Is the performance as good as the claims? Can it really hold steady power? Okay, let's find out. Alright, let's kick things off with the basics. Here's what the D1 Hydra is packing. Hash rate, a 33 giga hash rate per second. There's some serious firepower for script mining. Power draw, 9300 watts. Give or take 5%. Yeah, it's a beast. But hey, it's water cooled. Efficiency, about 280 joules per giga hash. Not bad for this much hash rate. Cooling system, Custom pattern water loop, we will break that down in a minute. Weight and size, it's around 21.8 kg. Dimensions are the are 90 by 445 by 655 mm. Solid but not oversized. Algorithm. So you are good to the go with the Litecoin, Gold, Bell, Pad, and more. Okay, let's take a closer look at how this thing is built. First off, the body. It's got a solid metal casing with a matte black finish that just feels premium. It looks stuff. And yeah, it is. Right in the center, there is a big work miner logo. Can't miss it. It gives off that way mean business vibe. The design is clean. It's a rectangle with smooth edge. No flashy gimmicks. Just functional and it weighs around 28 kilos. So it's solid but not unmanageable. Bottom line, it looks like a serious piece of gear made for serious mining. Now, let's talk about what this thing actually does when it's up and running. Let's go! Let's check the test data. With a rate power consumption of around 9300 watts, it's definitely a high performance unit. But that's expected when you are cracking out this much hash rate. What really impressive is, is the cooling the custom water loop is like a six lane highway. The cool land flows smoothly, evenly, and quickly, keep everything nice and cool. And yeah, the heat dissipation is top notch. The time difference between inlet and outlet water is upsized and pull the heat straight off the chip and get it out fast. Now, let's get into the numbers the part everyone cares about. Amusing your electricity costs around 5 cents. You are looking at about $11 a day in power bills. And with current coin price, the rig can pull in around $45 to $50 a day. Do the math, that's about 35 to 40 in daily profit. Not bad, right? That's why it's sitting at the top of the script mining profitability charts right now. So, bottom line, the D1 Hydro isn't some entry-level toy. It's built for serious miners. Forced with three-phase power setups, running dense racks, and who wants performance without the fan noise? It's not the cheapest and uh, definitely not the smartest but it delivers industrial-grade performance in a surprisingly quiet package. Stable, powerful, efficient, 
the things the real deal. If you found this video helpful, smash that like button, drop a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. We've got more deep dive mining reviews and insider tech coming your way. See you next time.